Now, this is what we're going to start with here. Uh, again, I don't want to sit and wait for a rendering here, but this is, if anybody's ever taken a class from me before, this is our our small bridge uh, that we use in rendering class. And we used to put trees beside the but beside the river here, beside the creek. And we used to do um, put rocks in here and, and do some fur growth on the grass on the outsides. Um, but this is basically what we're starting with as far as the rendering is concerned. Uh, the next image that we're going to show is what I did in Luxology, right? So I physically had to put the trees in here. I physically had to put the rocks in here. I set up fur growth. I set the water up as a material. Um, I can see that it looks pretty decent, right? Uh, not my finest Luxology. This was done in Luxology. Um, not my finest Luxology rendering, but you can kind of see some of the things that we did as far as for growth is concerned, rocks, trees. Again, remember, I had to use the populate command inside of MicroStation to populate the trees, to populate the rocks. And then I used a grass material and did fur growth uh, out in the side here and next to the river. Um, so for the time that I did this, not a bad rendering. I was, I was excited to kind of get some of this at the time, right? It was a breakthrough. Um, now we can do this. Okay. So this one here, let me, um, I can't remember what that view rendering did. All right. So that, that view rendering was 22 minutes. This view rendering that I showed you right here was 22 minutes. It took to do the fur growth and that's no volumetric effects at all. So fog or anything like that, that's no volumetric Effect, just for growth. and for growth really upped your rendering time as if you again if you've done rendering you know that if i add fur it ups the rendering time quite a bit so this was 22 minutes right this was eight minutes and nine seconds to do this in the view rendering inside of microstation inside the view rendering engine okay uh eight minutes and nine seconds the ecosystem is that I'm using is I created in the view standalone product, uh, putting in the flowers and the grasses, the rocks, the trees, okay? The atmosphere, the clouds and the skies, okay? That was a package, that was a prepackaged atmosphere that I got from the Bentley install, right? You got that atmosphere in here. There's a number of different atmospheres in here already. Um, the water, Again, water is kind of tricky. That looks more like ice than water, but I have worked on it since then. Uh, but again, eight minutes and nine seconds to do this rendering. Uh, I went back to and I edited the ecosystem and I added a few more trees. I'm blocking out my vehicles and blocking out my bridge a little bit, but I wanted to see what I could do with the trees uh, and the ecosystem, uh, putting in a couple more colored flowers and stuff like that, getting it right up to the edge of the creek. This uh, was I didn't time this one. Uh, here's another water looks a little bit better now. I've been working on the water. I put in a couple stumps over here, uh, changed the trees a little bit. I went with some um, coniferous trees instead of deciduous trees, and we still have the same atmosphere. Okay, uh, and you can see the detail on the grasses. Right, that's what really impresses me is the details on the grasses. It looks absolutely fantastic. That was eight minutes as well. Uh, then I tweaked the water a little bit. I wanted to show some rocks that were in the stream. Uh, I wanted to show some plants that were in the stream. Uh, we do have, I've just been playing around with, we have water lilies that we can actually float on top of the stream, on top of the water as well. But again, this is a stream, so you're not going to probably see many lilies, uh, water lilies or lily pads out there. Um, but I have played around with the water pet, uh, water lilies. Uh, they look really fantastic as well. But again, take a look at the detail of the, the reflections, the water, the detail of the water. This took five minutes and one second to render. Five minutes and one second, right? Um, absolutely phenomenal. If you found this video helpful, please give it a like. 
If you want to see more such series, consider subscribing to our channel. Thank you, and see you next time.